time. So getting to know your people is really important. Yeah, absolutely. And I think you you touched on something really important. You know, we touched, talked about expectations when you're hiring a property manager, but really in a lot of our key relationships, it's really beneficial to have that conversation about expectations right off the bat. You know, how do you prefer to be communicated with? You know, what kind of a business hours do you want to keep? You know, understanding and knowing what resonates with other people, that's the hallmark of a good manager, right? A, a good manager doesn't manage everybody underneath them, you know, the way they want to be managed. A good manager is able to be flexible and manage people in a way that optimizes or allows them to be able to perform at their best. And that's really what we do as real estate investors is I sort of almost view myself kind of a little bit like, um, like a, what's, the word just completely escaped me I right now. Who's the person who stands at the front and directs the orchestra? Who is that? Conductor. There we go. Conductor. <laughs> Conductor. So as a real estate investor, we're really conductors, right? It's not that we have to do everything or we should be doing everything, because as you mentioned earlier, that doesn't build a scalable business, but it's really about how do we find the right people and enable them to do what they do to the best of their abilities. 